Hey to all of our campuses, everybody joining us online here in the room. We are so excited that today is the day we get to do our official commissioning of Felipe and Mandy Santos into the lead role here at Echo Church. I want to invite their friends, family, members of our board up to the stage. As they are doing that, I want to make sure we all know that there are moments in life where God calls specific individuals and their families to assume a role of leadership in what God is doing in his mission. We get to see this in Acts chapter 13 with Barnabas and Saul. As they're meeting with the group of leaders of the church, the Holy Spirit said to them, set aside Paul and Barnabas and dedicate them to me, for I'm going to ask them to go and do a mission of work. And that is exactly what has happened here at Echo this last year. Uh, our founding pastors, Andy and Stacy Wood, felt God calling on their hearts to go and take over the mantle of leadership at Saddleback. And as they discerned and answered that call, it left a huge void for us here at Echo. And as we wrestled through that as a community, Pastor Felipe and Mandy discern that God was calling them to step up and lead our church. Now, I want to make it clear. This isn't like a promotion, like, ah, the top guy got out of the way, now it's my turn to step up. No, this is a very big, weighty decision. And they wanted to discern in a really strong way whether or not God was in this or if it was for somebody else to step in. And to our benefit, you and your family answered that call of leadership. Uh, and I also want to note that this isn't just on Felipe and Mandy. Hoffa, Faye, Lily, Kaylin, and Ephraim. You are the future leaders of this church. You are the ones that God is shaping through what your parents are doing here. Uh, and it's fitting that we're in the middle of a season and a series called Hearing God. We know that as you guys were wrestling through this, one of the most pivotal moments in this journey was your trip to London. Not only did you have people speak into your lives, but there was these visions and these insights that God gave you. And I know that your heart, Felipe, is that Echo Church wouldn't be a great church for now. That was never the foundation that we were built upon. But that this would be a church that builds for generations to come. So Vivian and Wadodo from our board couldn't be here, but we've got Dan and John, and they want to present your family with a commemorative plaque. Uh, you might have heard him share this story that they were at a church in Oxford that's been around for generations. And they stood with the current lead pastor looking at all the names that were part of the story and the foundation of what God was doing. And we believe that this is just the beginning of what God has done through Andy and Stacy, and as they passed it on to you to prepare the way for all the future leaders that are going to make an impact not only now, but into the future and at all of our campuses across the world. So one of the things that we do in these moments is we pray and we ask God to be in it. So at all of our campuses right here in the room, if you feel comfortable, would you extend your hand as we actually see it fit? to have Andy and Stacy Wood pray and commission the Santos family into this next season of leadership here at Echo. Awesome. Thank you. This is a moment that God knew would happen before time began. And when we sat in Stacy's parents' living room in 2007, he knew that today would happen. Yeah. And he's called you, he's anointed you, he's gifted you, he's appointed you. And this whole church loves you and believes in you and is behind you. Yeah. Stacy and I are so grateful for you guys. Yeah. So let us bless the Santos family. If you will, lift your hand in prayer. Father, we thank you for Mandy and Felipe and their obedience to you, their yes, that goes all the way back to 2007 on this particular vision when they said yes to you. God, you've been gifting them. You've been developing them. You've been preparing them for this moment. They are the ones that you have chosen, that you've gifted, that you're going to use. You've anointed them. And we pray now as they step in to this official moment where everything is, is uh, just continuing with what you've already started. God, this official moment that you would pour out a double portion of your spirit upon them. God, I pray for each of their children. I pray that you would bless them, that you'd strengthen them that you would continue to call them to yourself and to ministry and to be used by you. God, I pray that you would continue to call up men and women to stand with them, to support them, pray for them, encourage them, stand and uh, be a shield around them, God. 
I pray that you would continue to bless this church, grow this church, use it to change this region with the hope. Jesus, we declare that this church is built on you, the chief cornerstone, and you are the one who's brought us this far and will continue to take us into the future, that the best of what you want to do through the Santos family, through Echo Church, is in front of us. And we declare these things in faith, in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Let's give it up for Felipe and his family and get ready to transition to our message.